There's also one of the side stories you get earlier on in the game where, like, it's hinted even more grotesquely. That... It's like two lesbian scenes coming up. Oh, Alicia. They said it missed her organs, but she's still out cold, huh? Come on, boss. There ain't nothing we can do for her. Yes, Buff here. Cookie, that's absolutely what's going to be we happening. We really got our hands full, keeping those imps from crashing down on top of us. <laughs> we don't have our hands full. You're right. She got shot in the shoulder. We'll I be mean... back soon, Alicia. Don't worry, we have light bulbs that heal people. Oh, hey, it's our medic. Hmm? Sure, what's up? Well, it's... I imagine, Pop Tarts, if they actually alone. killed Vulcan first, morale would just go through the roof. Right. I'll head on what? No, screen. everybody loves Vulcan. Thanks, Largo. I, I Get meant everyone the ready to move morale. out. Oh, what, what, did, what the I'm hell does chat have against Vulcan? you've got a squad to run here. It's fine, what is it? Well... I removed the Hold on, we got forensics going it, on right here. When I took a look at it, it I don't know how anybody <laughs> Never mind. It's The bullet wasn't of imperial make. It was a Gallian sniper well, rifle round. Well, you know, sir. like everyone was saying how Alicia has a big what? heart, so maybe they were off expecting that she got clipped in the shoulder. Either. It's part of a new series still in testing. So you Oh, here we go. You There's a traitor in our midst. Our side? The no, plot fucking it's, thickens. It's like, Man, who in our squad does? Who in our squad has a face? And has been in every cutscene thus far. Hmm. But why? I, it what was for rot. Stand again from shooting <laughs> someone in their own camp. Oh no, it wasn't. It's probably Faldio. <laughs> I don't actually remember who shot him, but it, it seems it seems pretty obvious. <laughs> anime War, the, Anime World War Two was an inside job. <laughs> I believe it. It's that that, that sounds like the sort of treaturism I can get behind. With all due respect, General, I mean, would they just explain to us the near death experience? Uh, Why do the galleons make bullets out of bread? Oh, good point. Now, and think of a strategy to neutralize her safely. It was cool guy. Cool guy, shadowy ah, shit. Quiet, quiet. <laughs> cool guy. Just, now. In, in I the don't game. hate Alicia. Watch. Tomorrow okay, fine. Noon. You've got we me on motive. But I didn't have head. means. Every soldier we have fights. Every soldier we have fights. Know your place, Marat. <laughs> you are dismissed. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> the conspiracy <laughs> theories. Are we are we suggesting that there was a second loaf of bread on the uh, on the sandy knoll? Damn, it is not detectable out early. Oh boy, here come the bread puns. I think I really will need to start timing people out. <laughs> no, no, no. Bread pun. Bread puns are approved by Cool Guy. One hundred percent. I love their furry boots. It's like they're supposed to be fighting in like the winter, but there is no winter here ever. I really appreciate how the boots are not actually furry and would be terrible in the winter because of, because of all of the uh, places cold uh, cold snow can get in. All right, yeah. I really need to ban Shay Neckbeard for that. All right. That's like, <laughs> I like it. I like it. That's good. Your adversaries want to bring a war to this land. Kill them all. Oh uh, dear. Oh, hey, I was right. <laughs> I'd forgotten whether it was him or not, but like, yeah. basic anime. Shut up, cutscene! A good cutscene. I'll shut you up with the cutscene. Listen to me, Gallia. Cast aside your weapons and surrender. If you do not, Nagia's planes will drink deeply of your blood. <laughs> Oh my god. Drink deeply of your blood. Yeah, sure. I too have experience with no. battle. She can't be a Valkyria. Yeah, Alicia's looking all zombie-like. Get out of here! Get out of here! 
here. Get out. Dude. She's not just a Valkyr, she's a drunken Valkyr. Alicia studied under freaking the greatest, Muhammad Ali. She got a float like a butterfly, stink like a bee. It is a very pointy lance. Hey, cool guy, you called it. This can't be. Holy crap, I did. Yeah. Damn. And so we still have to fight with that on the field. Let me catch you up on the current situation. If it's a Lance White, well, well, that just happens. So we don't really, oh, like, okay. there's never been an explanation as to how the, the Valkyr do their thing, like, what they did. All we know is their, their weapons, that that lance and shield is made of the, the not uranium, Ragnite, to such a refined degree that it's, it can't be emulated. It's impossible. And even more so, it's like, they're, like, there's some kind of, like, genetics angle they play up by saying that they have Ragnite in their blood as well, which is why... Like it, 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 there's a lot of ambiguity to that. Like you could, you could assume that they either did some kind of eugenics program, or they were just some kind, like, or just you know, we go with the natural deity thing. I think I appreciate Pop Tarts Ninja's take on on this. How could I a say and lose? I, I like the uh, the idea that that everybody else will become increasingly irrelevant as the as the two Valkyria on. Uh, on on the battlefield like beat each other to an inch of their lives and become uh, become even more earth splittingly powerful all right I need to, this mission's a gimmick mission we need to we need to basically out gimmick the gimmick for, for everyone wonder, wondering about like lance combat uh never watch come and ride a guy there is a character who's whose entire thing is he uses like a, a lance type weapon as a sword the entirety of the show <laughs> it's just one of those things <laughs> even even when another guy uses the weapon um i'm pretty sure he actually uses it like a lance but this guy does not octavia i can't answer that question right now Squad seven. If there Move are, out. they're not called Valky Valkyrias. They would be called Einherjaro. Einherjaro. Because Ein Einherjar, it's basically, oh, wow. basically the. No, that's the that's the Nor the Norse uh Boss. the Norse general What's equivalent of. No, uh, I'm just mocking Valkyrie. your pronunciation. I don't know. Well, I mean, that Valkyria is is basically Valkyrie with the, with a the, with a weird a weird no Latinish lilt. You're saying Alicia's so Einherjaro would be Einherjar with you know a weird Latinish like lilt. It sounds dumber be, uh, because uh, because Latin based languages you use, uh, use O endings for We're masculine nouns. For anyway, the In the, meantime, the the reason we'll that those lances and shields like. They unfold when held by a Valkyrie is because if they're like some kind of foci for power. We'll never they'll never be a good answer because Sega doesn't care about the series anymore. The fools. That's well, actually an ace. Right there. Giving us, uh, at least they're finally giving us uh, you know that game we've always wanted on uh, on PC now. So she just sort of shambles forward like uh, like a magical zombie. I'm that's... not doing this. This is AI controlled. Brilliant. Anyway, she will not attack you like they suggested. No, she will kill every enemy on the field until you capture that camp. <laughs> every enemy. Except we don't really need to worry about that over much. I gotta kill that ace though. I know just the way to do it. So yeah, uh, if our tank was Gundam, um, Alicia is um, Zeta Gundam. <laughs> That's probably the best way to put it. Uh, yeah, she did beat the original. Like, uh, Camille ended up becoming, like, the the best new type ever, apparently. No, no, no. no. In terms of, in terms of, like, new type power, he wasn't, he wasn't right, enough top. He, uh, like, to say best when you talk about new types, it's like they manifest in so many different away. ways. But if you actually want to talk about the one with the most raw power, that's, uh, Jido from, uh, Double Zeta. Is it? Stay calm. Yeah, um, he gets so mad, he he actually manifests his, like, psyche 
as a giant fucking version of himself so fucking mad, it, like, terrifies everybody <laughs> and reduces, like, the enemy commander, who is, like, an extremely powerful new type herself, to tears. It's, like... <laughs> like, it's, like, one of those moments... I, I'm, like, I'm not like the... burning this guy alive because I'm enraptured by the story. Fire! Yeah. Honestly, honestly, I, I'm just, I'm just here. I hear, oh my you know, god, his leg! Elaborate god. setup to a you mad bro. Well, the thing is, like she, she, like the entire time, like Judo's like, I wanna, I wanna protect my sister. I wanna look after my sister. And then this lady Haman shoots his sister, and it's just like, okay, about like the nine hundred thousand things you could do to fuck up. You picked that one. You fucking picked that one. And now like, you she has fucked a... up. He now has no gun. Up. She has the gun, and he gets so mad, she drops the gun and runs off crying. Damn. <laughs> that's that's how powerful his new type powers are. Like Wait, well, okay, I'm done. Yeah. Shut up, Jan's talking. <laughs> Hi, Jan. Oh, that was dumb. I forgot they were like stacked together so well, but it doesn't matter. You got it, hon. Jan is kind of the best. You ever seen muscles like these before? I like how that barricade had five hit points. I should have moved the scout first. Like, I completely shot. blanked on this. Shot on it. Hey, it's no big deal. He'll get his ammo back. Whatever. Mm -hmm. On my way. I can dodge bullets, no problem. <laughs> Jen's just running off to pick up some dudes. He's fine. The intel reports live. Oh man, stop predicting. <laughs> that was stop. Fairly, it's fairly obvious when someone goes, I'm just going to leave this unit over here. Um... <laughs> on my way. Uh, I can dodge honestly, no Pop uh, like Oops. in Victory Gundam, it was basically just every woman projected themselves at Uso, like whether or not they were actually like dead as a ghost or just in a bikini. Um, they basically just yeah. Rest in peace. <laughs> Uso, oh, oh. Uso's new type power, I think, was just basically um, the unwanted attention of a lot of women. <laughs> They're all dead now, so Alicia's just gonna stand there. <laughs> She's just gonna stand there staring. <laughs> You're like, oh, I wish I had more to kill. Dead. Dead. That's Alicia. That's how dumb she sounds. <laughs> Although I'm kind of hoping I'll be proven wrong here by going out of order, but... <laughs> no, no, Victory Gundam is definitely not a harem anime. Um, <laughs> I never saw wanna, Victory. Like, it might, you might think it starts out as a harem anime, but it certainly doesn't end that way. Hey, Octavia, I'm metagaming here. Jeez. Dead. You've seen muscles like these before? <laughs> it's kind of like it starts out like one, and then they gradually reduce their numbers violently. Hey, Robokai. Like the opposite of Love Hina or hey, some shit. Hey, Robokai, I have a question for you. It's kind of an important one, so let me just get this out of the way. Have you ever seen muscles like these before? You ever seen muscles like these I've seen them on me. Flexes hard. And then pop and then ruptures a hernia or something. Leave it to me. You say that, <laughs> and now there is Alicia, like a Alicia can't capture the camp. Camera. Alicia, Alicia can't capture a camp, so. <laughs> Also, also, there is like a turn limit. You want to do this as fast as possible. So while it yeah, would be like three incredibly turns. cost efficient to uh, cost efficient to kill everybody using Alicia, uh, you generally don't want to because you want to, you know, you want to finish it quickly and get the get the. There's good no ranks. benefit to killing people anyway. It's like the only people who matter are the <laughs> red guys in the tanks. <laughs> this this the war only killing people, people does not matter. Red guys, I immediately have I have a uh, have a flashback to cow and chicken on on uh, the red guys on, who never wear pants. Yeah, on on freaking Cartoon Network where they had like the devil, which they later renamed the red guy, who just had this massive <laughs> ass. Dude, I remember that show. Is the most common name they used for him was Lance Sackless. Lance Sackless, that was true. That was true. They had a lot of different names for him, but that one was the one that got the most play. <laughs> Gosh, that was a long yeah. ass time ago. Way. How the hell do I remember yeah. that show? I can dodge even? bullets, no problem. <laughs> I will. I will say, um, uh, the uh, yeah, but I, was, I wanted to say like Super Robot Wars is definitely one of those games where it's like, well, I'm just gonna leave some of these guys here. After you've played the game like once or twice, you're like, okay, well, I'm just gonna leave this guy here. Uh, for for reasons that's like you kill like two dudes and suddenly you know, like the 
entire other enemy spawn, like spawns, and you just wipe them out. I could have probably done it in two turns. I think I might have done that at some point, but I don't really care. <laughs> it's fine. Oh no! Infartments. Get ready. Get ready. Pressing reinfartments. <laughs> you might have you might have heard Alicia was about to open up on him as well. <laughs> that would have been yeah. a bit unfortunate for him. This like the sound of just her powering up to destroy him. I can dodge bullets, no problem. I can dodge bullets, no problem. <laughs> oh no. You're gonna capture that shit yet? Okay, good, you are. Yes, that because was it, that's the hell out of me. Well, because it's all about scripting on this map. I don't care what it's about. It was triggering me, and that makes it important. I think a bit of the Japanese voice acting was left in right there specifically. Alicia. Yeah, Medic! her uh, her like pressured gasping what or whatever happened? the fuck that was supposed to be. Certainly did like not sound, that sound like the, the alto voice me? Alicia. Yes, sir. I love shaking text boxes. What, now? <laughs> what happened? Oh, I don't know. Your That's patient got up, walked out, glowing, and blew up everybody? What the fuck kind of a medic are you anyway? Hey, cool guy. <laughs> I need some input from you on these, you the these, these new enemies. They'll describe them in a Medicine second. Fire incendiary rounds. The impact explodes into a broad blaze. That flame can get at you even in trenches and takes a while to die <laughs> down. Camp open. Be careful. It's a in this bait. Okay. Change of plan, Sevens. Hold the Ooh. camp and take down those tanks. Incendiary rounds. Yeah, they're pretty horrible. It's Willy P. So Ooh. what I'm hearing is that they're shooting ah, white phosphorus great. rounds. Ah, this is great. So they, we have two snipers in an impossible hill, like on on top of the mountain, that will just be there, and we have to take out these two tanks now. And you only have three turns to get the A rank. This is great. And they're also got a huge escort. That's uh, yeah, huge escort is not freaking lying. But Holy hey, here's the, buckets. here's what's good about it. Uh, Jan is behind one of the tanks already. Yeah, I noticed that. <laughs> you can see that in the mini map. So that guy's, that guy's oh, they have way more HP than regular tanks. I should just point that out. <laughs> One enemy tank so hey guys, how do you feel about go, these muscles? Yeah, demolished up, boy. The dromedarius. What, that what is that? Yeah, look that up for me because I don't remember. What dromedarius? Yeah, well, dromedar dromedary refer uh, refers camel? to a camel. Yeah. Leave it to me. Yeah, I mean. I mean, it's not just a camel, but you know that's the most uh, that's the most um, that's the most well uh, well known animal in the family, Dromedarius. But yeah, so yeah, I mean that's that uh, it's the Arabian camel, and apparently it's because it has uh, it has flamethrowers are really bad. Like that's really what makes strategy in this game such a bitch, right there. I was aiming right at that guy, didn't kill him. <laughs> he just. He that, just didn't want to get set on fire. Yeah, that was pretty. That was pretty awful. Also, the the design of of the dromedarius B is kind of giving me an aneurysm. Destroying the target is your top priority. Next time on dromedarius B. I can kind of I kind of see like dromedarius is A B C D and E or whatever form, uh, forming to forming to uh, to. Com uh, like combining to form the Dromedarius Zord. You got it. Running over Robo your teammates Robo is really viable forwards, means no of problem. making them go forwards. Robokai is the head and Cool Guy is the legs. Either that, either that or the body because, uh, because you know, I kind of need to take a pee right now and I'm trying to hold off. Wow. You could get up and leave. I could, but I'm choosing not to. Well, wait until this tank, wait, it. wait until the tank explodes. Yeah. Yeah, that was that's exactly why I'm waiting. Thank you, thank you for spoiling that for everybody. Hey, this war would be over a lot quicker, Brewski, if everybody listened to Welkin's orders. Sweet we didn't be in this mess. I, we're I just gonna it. we're just gonna pop some heads now. Oh yeah, it's, 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 what are you not? <laughs> well, you know, I'm fine with it. I'm just like. You know. Why do you think I brought her? <laughs> just stand there this waiting. The whole this time, is just going. Man, I'm gonna get my kill on today. This is an order. Shoot the enemy until they die. Checkmate. 
<laughs> they are the cyber demon. I mean, they got Marina Nothing to one personal. side, Jen to the other. There's, uh... That sniper rifle is Man just down. the best. I God, that sniper rifle looks so cool. <laughs> I was like, I wonder how long, like, at what a time spent for each right, turn into this up. game. Oh, this is like, just getting in, gratuitous. I, 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 we need here. In, in Super Robot in Wars, works. like, by all accounts, by their metric of time, um, a turn can be a minute. Begins. Like, they'll often say, hey, we've got five minutes to get out of here, and so they class that as five turns. That so, um... Yeah, so I wonder what I wonder what the time span is for this, where Marina just, like, rapid fire comes down like five dudes. Man. <laughs> I mean, uh, or Alicia <laughs> clears an entire map, like as a, a like kills like five guys on the way. I yeah, I mean, if no we're going problem. by uh, by D and D standards, one round is supposed to be six seconds. <laughs> is basically oh crazy. yeah, hubris. Did you hubris yourself? No gun, no ammo. No, no, it worked. Operation no, I lined up the man. shot. Yeah, th that that was totally. Oh, right. okay. <laughs> That's that, you'll, you'll, <laughs> that's you'll, that's just being a fucking show off. <laughs> that's oh yeah, two kills. <laughs> just two kills, a tank and a dude in one in like one firing thing. That's pretty impressive. In one rifle clip, no less. The watershed battle on the <laughs> We just killed the entire sniper leaf franchise. <laughs> what price victory? Well, thank you for letting me know. I don't need to see it this one. I'll be right history, back. Not only with its ferocity. <laughs> But with the duo. Oh, man. But it made we, history because two challenge. magical girls showed off, you fucking douche. We won we won a watershed. That's pretty cool. Now we finally have a pl place to put all our water fell to retreat in this desert. While I, it's not really a desert. It, this was actually a, the site of anime World War One as well. That's why it looks like such a shithole. That's why all these trenches are still there. Man. Galia doesn't doesn't do so good with Alicia, the whole the whole right? wall, wars in its territory thing, does it? No, but they won. That says something. Mm. Yeah, I guess. I'm. You know, what if you could say you won, uh, like anime World War remember. One, I imagine it was probably just as <laughs> unfun to win as anime World War, like as real World War One. I, 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 I wonder what the I wonder what I wonder what the anime Gulf War is but like. Here I am, alive and you know, in you. like in Valkyria, like in the Valkyria Chronicles setting, and when they, like, you know, when this goes on, and like anime Valkyria Chronicles setting, Japan decides to what like make anime. So we have Has double anime. Do you think they'll make Valkyria Tell Chronicles, me, which will be an anime anime World War Two? We're reaching critic like there. There's a, this is a <laughs> level of anime I don't want a part of personally. Are you talking about like? Just, are we talking about like Star? What are we, anime look like? Are we talking about like Star Ocean <laughs> Three anime levels? <laughs> where know, where honestly. where anime world anime anime World War Two exits the anime ness and then enters anime World War Two itself? Or would they make? Or would they just make a game about like about regular World War Two? <laughs> They're already doing that with Yojo Senki, so I mean, oh well, that's World hey, buddy, War One. Look, it's Faldio, uh, a man, a man who has basically crossed a very terrible line and done a very terrible thing to somebody. Sounds good. Come on, pal. Hang out with me. You know, I remember doing this in Metal Gear yeah, Solid 3 and he threw up, but I don't think that'll happen here. Good dog. <laughs> good dog. Very good boy. You can see... It still tries to chat. Alright, I'm back. Fucking Ted. <laughs> oh, Ted. <laughs> Tries. She lives with a fox she found injured in the mount in the mountains. Well, hopefully it's a friendlier fox than the, uh, than the ones that harass Chip all the time. Parting ways, My cool guy. This is this is where it all ends. I'm sorry to bring you down like this. I have proof. We gotta we water. gotta figure out more about that bullet we did uh, field Freeze. on site forensics on. Results on that thing I asked you to look into. We're hitting all the crime show drama cliches right away. You gave me. Its shape and markings perfectly match get that rounds thing I sent you. Experimental Gallian sniper rifle. Uh, what? I know Harvey Birdman. That was a so weird Alicia show, but really I liked was it. Shot by someone inside the Gallian force. But isn't the response so usually like they just complete it? silence? And he's like, "Did you get that thing I sent you?" Yes, no, frequent, uh, frequently, uh, frequently, frequently, pe uh, people nod and smile me, to please. him. 
Because apparent, apparently Potamus is actually doing work, shoot, though uh, God only knows Lanza what the fuck that's supposed to be. What? Faldio had the gun? Are you sure that's not some mistake? So Faldio's plan this whole time was I'm gonna shoot Alicia, it's gonna make it's gonna activate her Valkyria powers. And you know what? He was completely right. It's rare for a tank commander yeah. to ask for a sniper. He was completely pilot. right. But um Sir, a bit rude, to be honest. You know, yeah, he is acting I'm completely up. like without knowledge of anyone else's awesome. knowledge. Didn't even share his findings with Welkin when he realized that Alicia was a Valkyrie at all. No, fuck that. I'm just gonna go shoot her, and we'll have that power, and it's gonna be like our nuclear deterrent. Yeah, That's exactly even, his reasoning. Like, That's his deterrent. Yeah, it's not even like, it's it's not not even like he told like the upper echelons are like, well, we'll put her, <laughs> you know, we'll, we'll get you to, you know, force you to shoot her so that no, it was entirely all done on his own initiative. And well, like, to be fair, like, you can't trust the upper echelon because it's General Taman. <laughs> I mean, yeah. this kind this kind of sound uh, sounds like uh, sounds like those weird cats that uh, ostensibly hey, found some, uh, found something interesting you about win? the thermodynamics surrounding cold fusion, but instead of submit, yes, uh, submitting to peer review, they just called a press conference and and stirred a whole bunch of people you up over something that uh, that was uh, that wasn't provably yeah. true Maybe only instead on of you know causing uh, causing a pseudo scientific frenzy some uh, some poor chick mm -hmm. got shot in the taco this is his handwriting you know that was a great ending to something <laughs> that I wasn't even paying attention to <laughs> no one, no one got shot in the groin loon wasn't behind the sniper rod. alicia must be made to awaken who the fuck keeps <laughs> journals man this, this is his George Washington, and Thomas Paul Jefferson, Paul Benjamin Franklin. No, but who George writes that? Jackson. You know, who's who keeps journals saying I'm going to shoot someone on my own side? This is like this is like OG Simpsons. If I did it, <laughs> <laughs> it, it kind of is actually. Exactly. <laughs> I'm convinced that the inner chamber was going to admit only Valkyra. But the door opened at her touch. No, he feels really bad oh, about it. Oh, 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 when I did it. Courses through her veins. <laughs> Still, I was shocked to find her bathed in that uncanny light that night. Yeah, in the everybody, field. everybody, like, Though I doubted keeps journals. Eyes. Like, I don't, like, I like wartime journals were, were a thing. I mean, it's like... Yeah, but he's writing down about how he shot so, Alicia. Something no so incriminating in your journal, perhaps? That but I guess... Uh, yeah, that's really close well, to I the guess question, guilt I was probably his primary motivator. I think I guilt was, like... The walls of the temple I think were he definitely wanted to get found out. As he does regret it, but his reasoning is that, you know, he thinks that Gallia could never have won without the power. And to be honest, yeah, we were kind of fucked. Let's be, let's be real here. She was kind of blowing everybody up, even without, like, aiming at anybody. She would still blow everybody up. And then, like, I don't think capturing the flag could stop that. Drunken kung fu's her to, like, to, like, oblivion. It was great. Yeah, that kind of owned. I'm not gonna lie. I, cool guy, I appreciated monkey, it. I saw about three or four episodes of, of that of that Their anime. It was just like done. This is too traumatic. Vastly superior. <laughs> oh dear, I like I liked Madoka Magica more when it was Kamen Rider Yuki. Is that is that like seriously a thing? It was it was ripping off. I, I don't know enough. enough hey, we're learning about, really about important history right here. This is not important at all. No, he's talking about how the <laughs> like that that calamity that Darksons are blamed for it was actually the Valkyrie that did that. Like I said, this is not important at all. <laughs> Surprise! It, it turns out it turns out the Valkyrie also kept a journal on their walls. <laughs> that basically yeah, but only they could read it. By O.J. Simpson. <laughs> <laughs> everybody <laughs> really wants to, everybody here is a serial killer who honestly wants to be found out <laughs> yeah it's like except in their cases, they, they kept it they kept it in the in a locked glove box in the in the in the bronco on the <laughs> holy Dude, shit Naren, this goes on forever Naren, I, I actually I actually started listening to uh, the first black company book, uh, book today I do like almost all all of my quote unquote reading through uh, through audible and I'm about an hour in now so far I've I'm but really enjoying the book. This is there's actually something important we need to like to talk about Valkyrie what's the empire like he's just talking about how you know there's people who are Their who have the Val the Valkyrie genes in them but they'll never know All because you know they they'll never touch the lands and shield but 
Silvaria admit like talked about how she was basically a, a, a vat child, correct, like that she was experimented on since birth, and this comes up in VC two as well. Um, so Maximilian's basically pushing for research on the Valkyr. Like that, the Empire knows about this. They have all these resources. They've they've apparently like what's what's the word? They've invested in this. And it's all because of him. And in VC2, um, the, the woman behind this, the woman who did, like, who, who, was, who was working for him now out of a job because he's dead. Like, yeah, he dies after this game. Big fucking spoiler there. But um, she's at she's at the, uh, the lo like, because the VC2 takes place a couple years after this game. And uh, she has a Valkyria with her, and she's still doing her experiments at the, uh, the, the academy, the war academy that trains Gallia's youth and war fighting and all that. Yeah, she's still got that going on. She's got like a conspiracy going on with the headmaster, where they're they're trying to create no artificial Valkyria as well. Behind it. <laughs> this kind of sound, uh, sounds like how uh, the Nephilim in uh, Diablo and Diablo, uh, Diablo Two and uh, well, and Diablo Three, I suppose, end up wor uh, working out in that. Yeah, all humans have. Uh, technically have, uh, have a fair bit of the uh, the original nephilim who had no uh, no reasonable uh, no reasonable li um, physical or or mental limits wor uh, worked at, uh, worked out in them but most of them just would never would never be be placed on, under the sort of uh, the sort of pressure or circumstances that uh, that would have caused their their nephilim uh, their nephilim latent or latent powers to awaken um and yeah Hands to to blood, elaborate on on love. some of the chat that's going uh, that's going on the black company books are written are written by glenn cook and now they're they're dark low uh, low Choice fantasy right. um morally ambiguous i'm having a lot of fun with it so far because wizards are dicks oh, and everybody yeah. knows it and so pe uh, people Whoa. are just like fuck wizards and they kick him in the Hello, dick lieutenant gunther is something wrong oh, fuck, that was a lot of I Where is he? That was that was some exposition. Sir, Folio! Captain Varat just called him in. He left only a minute ago. Uh, take off Welkin's your pissed. You shot his girlfriend. You. Uh oh, I think Welkin's a bit of a, a bit of a sad panda oh and a boy. bit of an angry panda. Uh oh, here we Got go. Cut scene. He's gonna he's gonna make like a super angry beetle and kick the door in. <sighs> wow, that was timed kind of well. Faldio. I'm only going to ask you this once. Wow, so that was time kind of well. <laughs> I love Pharaoh's look. I shot her. Get hit him. Oh. Uh. Now tell me why. Why did you have to shoot her? The people. Okay, now. Talia needed her. There you go, Robokai. Are you happy? He punched him. How else do you think we could? I, I would only be happy if Faldo was like, "Yeah, hey, my actually, own father's not playing all his pads in the God, journal, dude." That you just lost. finished reading. Yeah, but I think I think in the case of Wilkin, it was more like, "I'm reading battle. these words, I'm but all I'm seeing is get mad, get mad, get mad." Hey, cool guy, remember how you were talking about Varat being a uh, very cool-headed CEO? Yeah, it's gonna come up here in a second. So listen up. <laughs> she's just left it out, man. <laughs> she's just Wrong. sitting there, just let these two guys argue about how one of them fucking friendly fired. All it does is escalate the conflict. Oh God, the That's enough. Listen to each other. You may both be right, <laughs> but still, this watch. Here we go. Anti logic about escalating conflict over either. here. However, regardless of the reason, attacking one of your own comrades is deplorable. By Gallian military law, I remand you to the stockade until further notice, Faldio. And you, Welkin. 24 <laughs> hours in isolation for engaging in fisticuffs. Yeah, have a fun, Faldio. <laughs> fisticuffs! Fisticuffs! <laughs> Citadel 